hello students hope you are doing well tnea that is tamil nadu engineering admissions is a centralized counseling process that is conducted by the directorate of technical education that is dte tamil nadu the admission process is conducted for admission to bachelor in engineering or btech courses offered in various government and private engineering colleges across the state the aspirants must register for the admission process conducted by tnea in order to be eligible for the counseling process in this video i'll be discussing the detailed application form filling process for tnea while covering the important aspects such as dates process documents fees etc tnea registration dates the candidates can check the important dates for tnea by clicking on the link that has been provided in the video description where they can find the complete schedule and all the important events of the admission process TNEA registration fee the registration fee for TNEA will be different from uh, for different category of candidates for general category candidates the registration fee will be 500 rupees for SC ST or SCA candidates the registration fee will be 250 rupees and addition fee for each special reservation opted by candidate will be 100 rupees extra Now let us look at what are the various documents that the candidates will be requiring while filling the application form for TNEA email id mobile number for registration class 10th mark sheet class 12th hall ticket or mark sheet school details for class 8 to 12th caste or community details for the reserved candidates aadhar card details parents annual income details if applicable credit card debit card or internet banking details for application fee payment special category preference and preference for scholarship scheme now let us look at the step by step process to fill tnea application form the very first step is registration the first step in registration process of tnea is online registration the candidates will have to visit the official website of tnea for which the link has been provided to complete the registration after opening the website you will have to click on new user registration enter all the details in the registration form and click on submit the next step is the generation of otp after submitting all the details mentioned above the candidates will receive an otp that is one time password via sms on their mobile and the candidates will also receive an email including the otp in it only after entering the otp the details of the candidates will be confirmed the next step is login and form filling the candidates will have to login on the tnea website by using their login id that is their email and password the registration form for tnea will be displayed on the screen the candidates will have to enter all the details as required carefully The next step is the payment of application fee. The next step in the application process of TNEA is registration fee payment. After completing the step 3, the candidates will th see three options: payment gateway that is IOB, payment gateway for Indian Bank and payment gateway for option 3 skip. The candidates choosing any one among the first two options will have to pay the application fee digitally that is by using a credit card debit card or internet banking facility. The candidates who will be choosing option 3 will have to pay the registration fee at the facilitation centers. The candidates will receive a confirmation message after paying the registration fee and they can proceed to the further step. The fifth step is the filling of scholarship information. The candidates who wish to avail various scholarship schemes through TNEA will have to fill his or her preference. After filling in all the details, the candidates will have to click on save and proceed. The next step is school of study information. The candidates will have to fill in all the information pertaining to their school of study starting from class 8 to class 12. The next step is filling academic information. In this stage the candidates will have to fill in the academic information after entering all of the details click on save and proceed 
The next stage, eight, is filling of additional information where the candidates will have to fill in other details such as mother tongue, native school, parent occupation, medium of instructions, and other details. The step nine will be for editing or saving the application form. As the candidates have already entered all the details in the application, he or she can edit the same if any changes is required. If all the information is correct, then the candidate can click on submit application. The candidates will receive a confirmation pop-up where they will have to click on OK. The last step is the printout of application form. Finally, the candidates can take the printout of the application form. The candidates must note that the printout of the application form should be submitted at the facilitation center along with all the required documents. Do like, share, comment and subscribe to our YouTube channel.